What is good, my borthers and sisters? I am Kirby One, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. Last time we were here, I took out the Fire Team Star Fire Crew base, the Sheeter base, um, that was over kind of by the Grass Gym in that uh, that region, and thus taking out one of the five Starfall boss member or Star Team Star members bosses, what you call it. Um, but it seems we got a little bit of backstory from it, and maybe Team Star isn't as all evil as they're made out to be, but or didn't start out that way, perhaps, but have become to be evil, as you know, as evil as students from a high school can be, um, but have become evil over time. Um, don't know, but we got a bit of the backstory, so I'm guessing as we defeat more bosses will flush out the story no doubt um then penny slash cassiopeia slash trying to still act like two different people showed up and gave us some uh resources in order to craft tms um gotta talk to her a little bit and that was kind of it kind of took up most of our time with their unique uh Team Star fighting style. So, with that being said, today I'm here. Hopefully, going to take on this Steel Titan. Eh. I don't know what level it is, if I'm strong enough for it, but hopefully, we can combat against it and maybe get Karayat on another upgrade. I guess we'll see. Where are you going, boy? Why are you running? Where are you running? There's nowhere to run. Follow it down its wormhole. At first I thought it was going to be a Steelix, but it's whatever this thing is. Orthworm, thus lurking steel titan. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh yeah, we're we're in good company here, level wise. Son of a bitch. I'm risking it. Risking it for the biscuit. Let's go. Get out of here, Orthworm. Eat your Herba Mystica. Level up. We'll get Arvin in here. Help us out. <clears throat> and it'll be good. Be good to go. Am I supposed to follow it? I want to heal you up. What's, uh, what's auto heal do? Just tell me what you used, though. Because if you used a Hyper Potion to get all the way up there, that's a pretty big sad face. I personally would have used a Combo Super Potion, regular potion myself, but... You may have just been, uh, it needs this X, X amount of XP, the lowest item to do this, Hyper Potion. Like, I don't know how the algorithm, the computer reads, the AI reads it. Auto heal. Come here, you son of a bitch. Where are you going with my Herba Mystica? I need some herb. This ain't a drug bust, I just need my herb. I ain't no undercover cop, don't worry about me. It's raining. That's gonna weaken Hades' power. Jesus Christ, this guy's just making all the tunnels. Dark 
Titan Orthworm began eating something. Kirby Wan, you managed to pin down the Titan. That's right. That's the lurking Steel Titan. It's, uh, well, it sure is long. I think our little friend might be even feistier now after eating those herbs. We're going to need to do this together, Kirby Wan. You know what, Arvin? You actually have been helpful, so... Kudos to you. A toad school? Not sure if that's the right move, but... Maybe Earth is good? I'm not certain. Because so, so far, he's been pretty helpful. Like, his type matchups have been on point. Good thing I'm using a move that is categorized as special. <laughs> Way to lower his defense. If anything, you're good cannon, fo cannon fodder. Not very effective. Yeah, I didn't think so. Did as much damage as it did, though, because I think it's weight-based, right, Grass Knot? Maybe lowered his defense? Not Toad School. Just glad it ain't my Toad School. You only had the one Pokemon? What happened to your Knackly? What happened to your... Other much you call it. Let's go ahead and hit him with another incinerate. Oops. Guess I should pay attention. Not check something on my phone. Is it because it's raining that there's a, not allowed to be a sandstorm? The earthworm fainted. We got it. That's right, you Orthworm. We defeated it. Good job, everyone. Mainly Hades. Val wants to learn the move Brutal Swing. We'll get rid of Rock Smash, probably. Rock Smash be my weakest move. Brutal swig, let's go. Oh, jeez. Oh, the bell's evolving. That's crazy. What's next in the evolutionary line? Your bell evolved into a Tinka Tough. Neat. This Pokemon will attack groups of Pawniard and Bisharp, gathering metal from them in order to create... A large and sturdy hammer. That's not gruesome at all. But I guess. Tinka tink, tinka tough. But I guess, hey, in the survival of the fittest in nature, right? We did it, Kirby Wan. Way to go, little buddy. Did you get a good look at its face, though? I didn't expect the Titan to be such a little cutie. I wouldn't exactly call that thing little, but... I bet if we go in here, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica it ate before. Let's go find it before that thing can regroup. Nah, yeah, don't matter, Arvin. Come back swinging at us, I'll take it down a second time. I don't care, I don't give a damn. I will take it out for us. Don't worry about it. Don't you worry your pretty little Arvin mind. I'm sure there's some here, too. Aha! Uh -huh. White Herba Mystica. <laughs> Let's crush it up into a fine powder. I knew it! I spy Herba Mystica. And then we punch it for... Oh, the salty Herba Mystica makes sense. Punch it for collection. Another successful search. We're on a roll. 
Now then, let's see what does the book have to say. Well, apparently salty herba mystica helps with aching hands and feet. Good for neurotherapy and numbness. When you got muscle weakness, it supposedly builds up strength again. Seems like it helps out with arthritis too. This will definitely definitely help Mabostiff, Mabostiff feel even better. Guessing they're trying to play off of Mastiff sort of deal. Come on, Kirby Wan, let's get some food going. Let's get going. Get some food made. Hiyah, huacha. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go, another of your favorite old Arvin sandwiches. And it comes with a special Titan badge. The Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. Hey man. Makes the little dopamine receptors in my brain happy. Seeing a, seeing a reward for all my actions. And, right on time. Speak of the devil. You know it. Crydon wants a sandwich. Figured this might happen. Don't worry, I made extra this time for that brood of yours. Sniff, sniff. Here you go, have some sandwich. Level up. Let's see what we can do next. Come on out, Mabastiff. Got some for you too, bud. Poor old boy. That's it. Small bites, small bites. And Crydon just takes the whole fucking sandwich. Oh, jeez. Level up! Can it jump even higher? Come on! At least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would ya? This brute seems to be benefiting from the herbs too, I guess, in its own sort of way. Oh yeah! Before I forget, Kirby Wan, take another look at this. There's always a Titan Pokemon near the Herba Mystica when we find them, right? Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that's making the Titan so big and strong. So does that mean a Titan's lair isn't really s some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? Oh. You done with your sandwich, Mabba Stiff? Oh shit. Speaking. <laughs> Rough? You you heard that, right, Kirby Wan? Mabba Stiff just woofed, right? Nah, I didn't hear a damn thing. <laughs> right? I'm not imagining things. When he's trying to get up. See? See that? I knew I wasn't just hearing things. Oh, Mabastiff, who's my best bud, huh? Who's the best of boys? You are, yes you are. <laughs> it's It's been so long since I heard that woof. Mabastiff is definitely getting better. Ever since I teamed up with you, good things keep happening. But we still got two more herbs to go. Hope you'll stick it out until we're done. Sure, it helps us too. Although the Earthquake Titan and I think it's a Dragon type Titan might be a little out of our level league for a little bit. Rototo Toe Toe. Professor Sada here. This is Sada. I detect that Crydon has regained more of its original power. Well, you're riding upon it. It seems it can jump higher if you press and hold the B button. If you want to give the button a quick press, it will perform smaller jump, press and hold, you jump higher than before. Oh, so maybe this is how I get around now. Please continue to take good care of Crydon. Sada out. This is how I get around those cliffs I said. Maybe there's going to be like a rock climbing thing or a wall climbing thing. It's probably just that I can jump higher now. Yeehaw, baby! What to do next, eh? Oops. 
That Titan's done. I can just fly here randomly. Oh, to that watchtower. Okay. Poison. And Team Star. Team Star fighting. Two gyms on the mountain. Ice and Ghost. There's an electric gym here. But my toad school ain't really all that good don't know no ground moves my only ground move is with steve psychic gym here which i can get through this tunnel now i think with the jump ability this is a dark team star base yeah this water gym toad school does no grass move normal gym normal gym that's the other, yeah, Dragon, Titan, and Fairy Gym. Nope, Fairy, Starfall Base. Let's see, let's see. Maybe I'll just try my luck here at the Electric Gym, and maybe I have to rely on Steve. And that's just how it's going to be, unfortunately. Rudy to 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 Hey Kirby One, it's me! How's the gym journey? Which one are you going for now? Wait, seriously? I'm close by. Hang on, I'll come say hi. Of course you're right here, snooping around. Hey, hey, there you are. Look at you with two gym badges already. Awesome! And this is the gym you chose to be number three, huh? Well, you're up to the challenge for sure, but like, just to be safe, you probably better have a pre-gym warm-up battle with me. Fuck it, let's do it. Yeah, that's that enthu there's that enthusiasm. Now let's go. Come on, the field of battle awaits. I just I just wanted to take on the electric gym. Now I gotta fight Nimona. She's champion rake, however will I measure up? Luckily for me, she's got a whole new team she's brought down to my level. She's like doing the gym challenge all over again. Before you take on the gym, it's good to see if you can find the battle cord in town and check it out. It helps to see where the cord is, what it's made of, stuff like that. Those things might affect how the battle goes. You know, Kirby Wan, one look at your face and it's obvious that you're getting even stronger. I think it's time I started introducing you to some of my harder hitters. Alright, ready? As ready as I'll ever be, you know, I'm just a simple small town boy from South Paldea and, you know, let's have us a fruitful battle. And I'm just here minding my own and keep on pushing and, you know, it just so happens that I met you and now we got a fight, you know. A rock rough? That's not a good matchup. No siree, Bob. Think of this as practice run for your next gym battle. Come at me with everything you got. How fast am I? Not fast enough. Can I tank it? I don't know. We're not going to risk it. We'll just send in Azumaru. Still not a member of the team. Oh shit. That's not a water move. You son of a bitch. No way. This thing's going to become too evasive. Nice. Oh, nice moves. Your skills sure are ripening.
Yeah, let's go. A palmy. Palmy is fighting. And electric. Shoot out my boy Steve with his mud shot. See if I have any ground TMs I can teach to Toad School. Have any on hand? I already checked if I could craft any. That's that was a no go. Can't craft any uh, good TMs yet. No, you son of a bitch. fell slow enough probably not oh it was perfect you'll love to see it that's right you palm me bitch get taken down soon a flora gato flora gato the grass cat tail as old as time fire burns grass am i right Don't pat yourself on the back just yet. My next Pokemon's gonna turn the tables. <coughs> Excuse me, I don't think so. Bonk. Since you have a Terra Orb too, we can both Terrastalize our Pokemon fair and square. Shit. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> you still grass type afterwards? Yeah. Seems like the starters. Even my Nackling just got a stab boost. Not like they did anything crazy. Why the hell not? Show me what you got. Like, so far, all my Pokemon, all I've gotten are stab boosts. They haven't been nothing crazy. Like, oh, here's a... Here's a normal type Mankey or anything. Or a... Ghost type. Tinkatuff. You know? Nothing super crazy like that. I'm also not really min-maxing to try and find anything crazy like that, so you could probably search for whatever terrestrialization you wanted. But, uh, not me. I'm just going with the flow. Whatever Pokemon I catch is the Pokemon that I get, and that's who I'm adding to the team. Level up, Chitaki. Ha ha ha! Uh, yep, your skills are ripening quick. Thanks, Nimona. Thanks for playing down to my level. <laughs> Man, you sure battle with like someone with more than two gym badges. Well, that was great battle. Fruitful, for sure. Here, take these as thanks. Three full heals. Noise. I challenge you again, literally, right now, but champions have to be understanding. So I'll hang back and respect your time. Keep on collecting badges for now, and let's battle next time we run into each other at a gym. And Kirby Wan, I hope you get even stronger. Like, way, way, way stronger. Jeez, thanks. And once you do, you and me can just battle our hearts out. Alright, time for you to whoop that gym test. Thanks for this. Happy to oblige, ma'am. Just hanging out, doing my thing. And actually, you interrupting my shit. Well, isn't that a fine how do you do? Hello, hello, hola, hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour. Bonjour, bonjour, bonjour. 
I'm assisting for the gym test. I'm standing by so I can jump in the moment they need me. Must have been tired. Fell asleep. Jolteon. Um, well, guys, I think I'm going to wrap it up there and we'll take on this gym challenge at the start of next video. Frickin' Nimona coming in and interrupting us. But what can you do with the pushy, pushy rival slash friend like that, right? Not a whole heck of a lot. You just kind of appease them. Let them be on their way. Okay, cool. So, that is going to do it for today, everyone. I would like to thank you so much for tuning in. But, the adventure is now over. It's time to go out into the world. And let's do some great things. And, as we say up here in Canada, Peace out.